In the heart of Denver, though, I want to find out exactly what road conditions are like because when we spoke with meteorologist Tracy Anthony earlier in the day today, uh, you know, just about an hour ago, uh, you know, it was still wet and, and streets were still OK, uh, but uh, we're since getting some reports of some different circumstances now. So meteorologist Tracy Anthony joining us now, uh, kind of driving through the downtown area. Uh, give us a report of uh, kind of what you're seeing starting to accumulate. Yeah, you know what, Mary, on some of the slower streets, we are starting to see that snow accumulate. We've had enough time to cool down throughout the day, so we're going to pull out here. We're just starting to run into that accumulation on the roads. Now, the main interstates still looking just fine. So we'll show you the roads that we're driving through right now, if you can see that. We're going to start to need those shovels. The interstates, like I was saying, are fine, but it's these back roads now that don't see the high volumes of traffic. The roads have started to cool down, and that's causing that snow to start to stack up. And let me ask you something, because you kind of live in this area of Denver, uh, kind of around the Denver metro area. Do they treat uh, some of these uh, other smaller roads as much as they would the interstates just because it's so busy down there? You know, it definitely depends. We've had a couple major snowstorms where we've had the snow still lingering a couple days later. But I know that we were anticipating for the snowstorm. Obviously, major priorities are those interstates, but I know CDOT was out through the weekend prepping for this snow, and that may be one of the reasons why this snow took so long to accumulate out on those roadways. Yeah, absolutely. I think you certainly got a point there. So if we're already starting to see that accumulation uh, in the downtown area, as you can see there, it's starting to stack up a little bit. You know, Tracy, we talked about an hour ago, and it certainly didn't look like this. Yeah, you know what, Mary? We're just kind of right at that tipping point, you know, and it's it's kind of bad news because a lot of drivers are going to be heading home from work. The morning commute was some smooth sailing, but now we're really going to have to battle with or battle the snow out there on the roadway. So we're just starting to see it on the back roads. We're going to start to see it here, I would have guessed, in the next hour, hour and a half, really starting to accumulate out on the major roads as well.